as I have loved you. Uh, this was a very serendipitous piece. It came out, uh, came about totally by accident. Uh, I was working on another piece, uh, a piece that had been commissioned by uh, a visitor center in Magdala on the Sea of Galilee. And when I do pieces that have uh, a representation of Jesus in them, I actually uh, get models, a model, someone that I can dress in a costume, that I can pose and light a certain way. And then I use my own imagination to kind of morph that model into a, a symbol of Jesus. So I was working on this other painting uh, that had Jesus in it, and I had, a, I had my model. I probably used 10 or 12 different models over the years. It's just kind of a starting point. But this particular model um, was here in my studio, and, and we had a photography session. He wasn't able to pose live for me. He was uh, uh, here for a photo session. It usually takes a couple of hours, and um, sometimes they're a little bit drainy. But he, he was a good sport. But we took, a, we took a time out. We took a break in the modeling session. And he went over, and I had a little stool in my studio, and he, he sat down on it. It was just a low stool. And he, he took a break for a minute, and I looked over, and he was sitting there cross-legged, and he kind of had his hands in this sort of heart position. And I know it sounds kind of kitschy, but it just stood out to me, and I said, yeah, hold still. And uh, so he just sat there, and I, I took a series of photographs of him in this contemplative pose with the symbol of this heart created by his, his hands. And, uh, and it was a, a reminder to me of the importance of uh, being contemplative. That, that's been a, a big thing in my, my life. My wife has uh, got me into meditating daily. And that's a time that I find where inspiration comes. That's where a lot of my ideas come from for, for new paintings. And this pose uh, reminded me of that. And I, I thought of Jesus being uh, one who would probably spend a lot of time in reflection and uh, in contemplation. And so uh, th those two things, the idea of, of love that he, that's symbolized with his hands and then just his pose of being in a, a state of reflection and meditation.